A case is a phone's best friend. Not only is it protecting its resale value and potentially keeping it from breaking, but it adds a bit of personality and style to your phone. I've gathered nearly 40 cases over the past few months, and today we're taking a look at my personal favorite five. Topping this list is the case I've used most frequently, the Rinky Fusion. The Fusion very well may be the best all-around case I've used, if not on the market in general. It's a clear case, but it comes in variants with black, mint green, or gray borders, as well as the all-clear one I have here. The first thing I noticed after putting on this case is that it feels great. The edges maintain a curve that fits comfortably in your hand while keeping your iPhone slim with almost no width and very little thickness added. It also adds grip, a lot of grip. You won't have to worry about dropping your phone with this case on. It also features the easiest to press buttons on any case I've tested. They're so nice in fact that you'll probably feel happy when pressing them. Well, maybe. There's also a good sized lip on the front, but I still recommend a screen protector such as the $7 anchor glass screen protector that I'm using now. And I'll leave a link to that in the description. On the back, there's four reinforced corners for added protection, as well as keeping the back clean when setting it down on the back of the case. On the very bottom, there are port plugs for keeping dust or liquids out, as well as adding protection. They're incredibly easy to take on or off, and have stayed secure after several months. Oh, and you can also make your own design and put it in the back of this case. For around $10, you cannot go wrong with this case. It's very thin, it looks nice, shows off the design of your iPhone, as well as adding grip and comfort to your phone. Coming in in a second is another case I used quite often. If you're looking for protection that doesn't create a bulge in your pocket, check out Urban Armor Gear's case. This modern looking case comes in 6 colors and offers an extreme amount of protection. It's constructed out of a hard plastic shell with a rubber border on the edges and on the top and bottom. It also features a good sized lip on the front as well as complete coverage for all your ports and very easy to press tactile buttons. Like the Fusion, this guy features raised corners for extra protection around the edges, and while doing all of this, it only adds a few millimeters of thickness to your phone. If you're looking for a good feeling, protective, and thin case for your iPhone, look no further than the Urban Armor Gear case. If you're on a budget and want something thin, simple, and clean as can be, check out this Tronics line of cases. They range in two styles, a regular and an ultra. The regular comes in matte variants in gray, black, or blue, as well as a glossy variant that comes in mint green. The Ultra comes in two colors, black and gray. It features the same matte texture, but includes a cutout for the Apple logo as well as thick reinforced corners. In fact, I did a drop test with this case on on concrete and it protected the phone just fine and you can watch that video if you want in the description. This case only adds 1.6 millimeters to your phone while weighing less than an ounce. The buttons are easy to press and this thin classy case won't be breaking anyone's bank. If you're on the market for a thin, simple case that gives you protection while keeping it thin and minimal, look no further than this case from this Tronic. If you're more interested in a super slim and simple case, Tech Armor makes one that is just that. It's a snap-on shell that will only provide back protection, and mainly just scratches at that. There's a very small lip on the front, but no protection on the top or bottom. It will, however, protect the camera from poking through, which also means no more rocking. You'll get some grip and some style, and for a low price tag, it's a good case for a minimalist. If you're looking for more color combination, check out Spigen's almost identical version of this case that comes in many more color options, and I'll leave that link in the description. If you're someone that wants a simple case that's not really too concerned with protection, well, this is a good option, and throw on the screen protector I mentioned earlier, and you're good to go. Rounding up this list isn't your ordinary case. If you're anything like me, the iPhone 6's battery occasionally suffers to get through a full day, especially with my phone being jailbroken. To fix this problem, I use a battery case. With a built-in 3100 milliamp battery, this case will provide a full charge and a half to your phone. So if your phone normally gets one day of battery life, theoretically with this case, you'll expect to get about two and a half days. Yes, it has some bulk and heft, but it's a worthy trade-off in my opinion. If you're worried about battery or ever someone that runs in a situation that you're often low on battery, get this guy and you really don't have to worry about battery anymore. Really for not too much bulk, in my opinion, this is an awesome case that will charge your phone quickly. So those are my top 5 favorite cases of 2015. I honestly think that otter boxes are unnecessary because that much protection is only needed for uh, a few individuals, the more extreme individuals. Also, Apple's case didn't make this list because it's just too expensive uh, for its lack of protection, although it is a quite nice premium case. So let me know your favorite cases. If you want to check out any of these, pricing and availability will be in the description, all links. Uh, and I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Uh, again, these are my top five cases, might not be yours. Uh, and I will update this list maybe later on this year or maybe just early next year. But thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.